Hello, and welcome to 4 Accelerator and another episode of How to Beat Deity. I'm your host, Stratagos, and today we're continuing our playthrough as Teddy Roosevelt leading America in the Industrial Era. Let's start by looking back at what we've done so far. So here we are. Uh, we started way back in the Ancient Era. We used boosts, uh, the Eurekas, as a way of uh, moving faster through the tech tree, uh, we were getting things along the way that we needed, so celestial navigation up at the top, buttresses, um, all the way to cartography, so we should tra could travel through ocean. But primarily, we were going for the bottom half of the tech tree on our way to first rifling to get the Rough Rider, uh, Teddy's special unit, and then to steel to get the Eiffel Tower uh, to get plus two appeal to all of the tiles in our civilization, which will enable us to put down more national parks and stronger national parks on the civics tree uh we were also using boosts here uh we went through uh, i believe it was oligarchy uh we stayed mostly in the middle until uh just recently then we stopped down and went down the bottom to pick up monarchy and then theocracy at reformed church and we're continuing on our way now we're almost to the eiffel tower so we want to pick up civil engineering at the same time after that, we want to pick up nationalism so we can form cores using our new Rough Riders. Then the plan is to use our new Rough Riders to attack Brazil. Uh, now, the Rough Riders get culture on kills, so we can benefit from getting extra culture just by being at war and taking down Brazil's units. Uh, but looking at how we are, if we were maybe going for a scientific game, this could be enough cities. We have a strong science game. We have a strong industrial hub cities. Uh, but if we're going for national parks, we're probably going to need a bit more land. So uh, the plan is to not just attack Brazil uh, and pillage their territory, but actually take down their cities and keep them. Right now we're at war with Poundmaker because he declared war on Brazil, who was our ally. Um, and we might just ex expand all the way into the Cree as well at some point, probably not in today's stream. Um, and we have the bonus from the uh, Teddy Roosevelt Special Roosevelt Corollary, which gives us um, a bonus attack strength on our home continent. And you can see that all of this territory here is our own continent. We're separated from Europe by um, several small little mountain ranges. Uh, so we'll get a, a strength bonus to all our military forces and religious units, by the way, um, on America, all the way down to Russia here at the bottom. Oops. Uh, now, we are playing Deity, so the Deity gets a combat bonus buff uh, against us, but uh, the Roosevelt Corollary will at least offset that and, uh, and maybe give us a little bit of an edge. Uh, and hopefully getting our Rough Riders early compared to other people, you can see that aside from Pachacuti and, and Wilfred well, and Poundmaker, uh, we have a high science. Oh, and Catherine. Okay, so some of the computers have caught up. But we have a higher science than Brazil, and our culture is about the same. Uh, so we should be able to use that science advantage to get our Rough Riders out. Uh, they get plus 10 combat strength on hills. There are a lot of good hill tiles around. So hopefully we won't have too much trouble with uh, Brazil. The only worry is that the only niter we could get was by putting Detroit down here on a niter mine. Um, and in order to do that, to keep it loyal, we had to get a cultural alliance with Brazil. If, when, we, uh, when that cultural alliance expires and we want to go to war with Brazil, uh, we'll, we'll then be getting loyalty pressure on this city. And the only question is whether we'll be able to keep it. Now, Brazil is in a normal age, as are we. So at least we won't be getting golden age loyalty pressure from Brazil on Detroit. So if we put a governor in, we might just get to keep it. Uh, if it does go down, then we'll just have to retake it after taking a few of Brazil's cities. Uh, fortunately, we do already have uh, cavalry over here and a bombard. Uh, we had to promote that bombard to shoot off some uh, Cree uh, ships from taking Detroit. You could still, you could see it's still a little weak, um, but here we are. So we just started the industrial era. We have to make a dedication. Um, I don't expect to do much naval fighting, so we'll pass on that. I have five trade routes. That's a decent amount, um, but probably uh, we'll also be building some industrial buildings. But probably two arms is the best bet if we're planning on going to war. Uh, in this era. So we'll pick two arms. Uh, choose a civic. 
We already have our uh, tier two government, so I think I'll pass on exploration, at least for now. We might come back if we need to produce some naval units later. Um, and if you were going for a science game, the Enlightenment would be good to pick up, but we're close to uh, as far as we really need to go for our science. The main thing we want to do is get to steel. Um, then we want to get to radio, but we can do that um, in a reasonable amount of time. We don't need an extreme amount of science, which is just to say we do want that card. We'll, we'll come pick this up soon. But first, I think we'll go straight for civil engineering um, and then maybe for conservation after we have nationalism. So we'll go straight there. Uh, here, the question is, do we want to build an archaeological museum or an art museum? We're going to need at least one archaeological museum just to uh, boost natural history on the way to conservation. Uh, and since I don't think we've built uh, any of these in any of our cities yet, we might as well just go ahead and build an archaeological museum in this city. And here's our bombard just to keep us safe, just in case those ships come back. Uh, siege units get bonuses to uh, naval um, uh, military units, that is, ships. So we want to get high production here. Uh, we'd also like to get our dam down before too long. Uh, so I'll just place that. We could rush it with a military engineer from New York. Uh, in fact, I think I will purchase some of those. 680 sure um but the main thing is we want to get production because we want to focus on building finishing this great zimbabwe that we have uh it'd be nice if we also picked up uh some gold along the way and i think uh yes let's see is she our ally she is not our ally uh but how long will this alliance last uh 13 turns okay uh so i, I want to put in the card for uh food and production from tr uh, trade routes to allies. So I suppose I might as well just send this to Curitiba right now. Um, and we'll put that card in uh, as soon as we can. Uh, we have Paul the Spy. Uh, he just finished the Siphon Funds, which is what got us so much gold. We're going to promote him now. And it looks like all of these are uh, counter-spying related quartermaster. Uh, our spies get plus one level in their operations, polygraph, other enemy spies get minus one. Um, and this one lets us counter spy in all city districts um, that we're defending in a given city. Now, uh, this is going to make our counter spy really good. And these are really only good if we are counter spying, but they don't make us better at it. So I'm going to start with surveillance. The next time we promote him, we'll have different promotions. Hopefully one of those will still be in. Um, and then we'll probably keep him around as a counter spy but we will set him to uh try to steal more gold the next time we get a chance uh and hopefully promote that way okay that's russia we want to keep an eye out for the kree uh, we don't want them to take detroit we want to keep getting niter from it and uh oh i can put the um i can put the card in now visselbanken to get that uh what else let me see. What are we going to be building? Uh, have two forts in our territory. We'll be doing that soon. This military engineer is going to build a fort there. Um, what else do we want to do? We want to keep the wonder card in. Yeah, we really need more housing in the city. You can see it's uh, minus two food just because it's way over its housing limit. <laughs> Uh, the question now is what units we're going to start building. I think, yeah, we'll we'll start building um, some Quirisers uh, and maybe some field cannons too. We also we have crossbowmen that we can upgrade into field cannons. We can also upgrade these horsemen if we get a chance. Um, so I think I'll just leave this card in for now. Or wait, or was there is there a niter? We don't have the niter card yet to get more niter from. Uh, sources. So we'll, we'll leave this one in. We'll leave the Limes defensive buildings in. Uh, Campus, Shure, The Wonders, and uh, Visselbanken. And we'll keep trying to get great rider points. Um, yeah, that looks good to me. We'll do that for now. And on to the next turn. The other turns, uh, I plan to go much quicker. Uh, this was just to 
uh, catch everyone up and uh, let you know where we came from and the kind of strategy we plan to use. We just lost suzerainty of uh, Zanzibar. That's because someone just took Zanzibar. I don't remember exactly where Zanzibar is. Um, it's less than ideal. We were getting some gold from that, but um, I'm not too broken up about it. Yeah, I, I can't even say where it was. Oh, there it is. So we might be able to free it, liberate it from the Cree later once we plow through Brazil. Um, I say it like it's a foregone conclusion, but it's possible that they'll fight back pretty hard. We'll just have to wait and see. Okay, oh, and we found a privateer. Unfortunately, it's out of range, um, but uh, we'll be able to keep an eye on it. Our caravel uh, is good against privateers, uh, so uh, that we, we have that going for us. Okay. Um, I got you to rush this dam. And I also, I think I'll buy another one just to rush the dam even faster. Oxford University has been built, uh, thus boosting out, uh, Wilfred's uh, science quite a bit. Okay, we do have a bonus with this against one uh, privateer, but two privateers is a different story. We will retreat and heal there. Uh, we did finally get a great writer. We got Jane Austen. So let's get some Pride and Prejudice going. That is a great book, by the way. If you haven't read it, I highly recommend it. The lady's it. imagination is very rapid. It jumps from admiration to love, from love to matrimony in a moment. And the Colin Firth version is, of course, a classic. Watching him dive into the pond mm, gets me every time. Uh, I would love to have this emergency if I were closer to it. I will pass on it for now because uh, it's just too far away. I won't really be able to get there in time. Unless maybe I just uh, allied with Brazil for longer. Um, which is an option, but um, then if we, we'd have to liberate that. And if we wanted to continue the war with the Kree, uh, we could do that. But we'd get, well, we wouldn't get loyalty pressure from Brazil. But it's just a bit far away from our cities. So we wouldn't be able to hold anything. It'd be a big hassle. Um, so we won't do that. What do we want to build in Buffalo? Um, it would take quite a while to build that. Uh, quite a while for that. Probably quite a while to build anything, really. Um, so we might just build, I don't know, um, a caravel or maybe a quadrireme, which we can then upgrade. Um, yeah. Let's just try Caravel. Or, eh, let's just get our medieval walls. I'm getting medieval walls everywhere for the um, tourism, by the way. And here, this city has relatively low production, so I think I'll get an art museum instead of an archaeological museum, because that way I won't have to um, build an archaeologist. Uh, I could also, it might be a good time to start filling out these uh, holy sites because I want faith for our national parks and we're almost there. All right, move you, move you. I'm moving them over to the dam as I finish the wonder. Um, I will cycle the dam into construction to expend a charge and then uh, switch back to the wonder. I am a wonderful foe, it's true. Okay, so here you can see... Oh, this is not good. City-state emergency. Yeah, I can't afford to uh, join that right away. Uh, so here we have two privateers. They can attack the city. But then the caravel can sneak in, and right now it's uh, it's out of range of my bombard, so there's not much I can do. There's a good chance uh, they'll take the city. Oh shoot, and that didn't even destroy it. Um, I I don't want to lo lose this cavalry if it goes down, but I also want a higher defense strength. That's just the problem we're facing. Um, I think I'll leave it in uh, just so we have the the possibility of keeping that city i would really like it just to keep getting niter because that's the only source we have um, there is some niter right here so as soon as we take down a city we'll be able to get more 
Um, but uh, we would like it now. And I'm going to put down this fort. I got a milita military engineer to put forts down there and there, um, which is great. They're on hills. They're on our border. Um, they're close to some encampments, or that one is at least. Um, but mainly I did it for to get this boost to ballistics. And you can see we did it just in time uh, to get it on the next turn. Here's Sense oh, of Sensibility. And we'll move on. We've also been declared... Uh, well, there were some more decks going on. Um, okay, they don't really concern us. Maybe a city-state. Uh, ah, Muscat. Uh, so Amani had to flee Muscat, which means I can use her again. Um, uh, am I going down in loyalty? I am going down a little bit in loyalty here. It's very slow, so I'm not super worried about it. Um, I'm more worried about this caravel that's trying to sneak in. We almost got it before, too. We almost destroyed it. Uh, yeah, I won't be able to get this caravel out. All right. Hopefully, hopefully we'll keep this city. Uh, hopefully the computer does something dumb, which they often do. And then we'll switch back to Great Zimbabwe, which is what we really want to get right now. We're starting to get cash uh, flow problems. We're only making 50 per turn. Ah, uh, that's too bad. Let's get on our knees and pray. Uh, I probably should have just gone through the privateer, but I want to get it away. Uh, I think I'll put it well there, maybe, and uh, start hitting the city, and I can uh, get that. The plan, yeah, I should have pulled that cavalry out, then I could use it here. The plan is to um, take it back using my ground forces. Um, yeah, I just lost that caravel. Uh, that's fine. We're all fine. Another charge on the dam. I can put a charge there. Back to the Great Zimbabwe. Um... I'll move these horsemen down to try to help us take back that city. Maybe these guys too. Uh, build a niter mine, yeah. So there's no niter mine for me to do this on. So I might as well uh, just hard research it. Build a, a niter mine. I also uh, don't have coal. I would have had to make a detour for that. So I'll just hard research steel as well. And then we'll be able to build our Eiffel Tower. Okay, Wilfred went for Big Ben. That's actually good news. It means he's probably not getting the Eiffel Tower. Ah, it's that privateer down there that got us. Uh, I think I'll fire back. Hopefully this destroys it. Not quite. That's too bad. Uh, ah, reveals oil. Okay, well that's very useful. Uh, and we got our third great person, so we did the boost for Enlightenment. So what does he do? We get two random technologies, and we reveal oil. So let's just look right now and see where the oil's going to be. Uh, it does not look like there's any in our territory. Uh, that's unfortunate. Not even up here. Yeah, no oil. There's some oil up there that um, Arabia got. There's some oil there. Ah, there's some good oil out here, so we might want to build a settler just to uh, put down uh, some cities to get all of these oil sources. Maybe one there, one there. Um, that's our best bet. That'll really help us in the long run. No oil up there. Uh, we also have this little uh, Hawaii down here. Doesn't look like there's any oil there either. There's only 14 sources that we've discovered. That is not a lot. Um, can't even get that one unless you settle there. Valletta has some oil. Brazil has some oil. Russia has some oil. Yeah, so we're going to try to get out a settler for these spots. Uh, that'll make our modern and uh, so on uh, military much stronger if we have access to that. Um, where we're building, we got this one for, um, with Magnus right now. 
We'd like some food here. Um, we're past our housing cap here, so I think we'll build a settler or two in New York uh, right after we finish that uh, military academy. We would like, we'd like everything here, but we'd like to start with the workshop since we're about to build our uh, Eiffel Tower soon in this city. This has 52, this has 51, that's not bad, and we'll switch in those uh, lumber mills when we need to. Right now I'm happy for Boston to have it, because Boston uh, took a long time to get going, it still only has 10 production. Um, and we are still building our Great Zimbabwe. What do we want to do here in Baltimore? Uh, right, we're filling in our uh, holy site. We could do the same here, we could also put down commercial hub that wouldn't be a bad idea we uh sorry a commercial hub or it looks like a theater square we could get a plus one not great but it's okay um we would like gold so i think i think putting down the commercial hub would be a good idea yeah and we get a big discount on that as you can see um, we might as well just focus uh, production since the city's at its housing limit. In fact, maybe we want to build a settler here. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Keep moving. And back to Great Zimbabwe. Hopefully we get that. Um, we built the Temple of Artemis earlier um, and the Petra basically just because we could and that was a good Petra city. Um, and now we're building the Great Zimbabwe, again, basically just because we could. Um, none of these wonders are uh, crucial to strategy, but if you get a chance, you might as well go for them. Are we still at war with a cod? It appears not. Uh, the Kree must have lost them. Yeah, right now their suzerain is no one. Uh, we could become the suzerain of Bologna. Holders march in formation. Oh, and we still have Omani to send somewhere. Right now Omani is worth two, so we could... No, we can't send her there. We could get control of Fez if we wanted. I think we'll just take Bologna. Um, but why don't we just send Omani there first? Let's save our envoys for later. Uh, when we become their suzerain, they'll reveal some of the territory around them. Maybe there's some more oil there. We don't know. Uh, we want to build a settler here. Four turns is not bad. Alright. Uh, we just got our walls hit. That's why uh, we can't finish uh, building them. You have to have full health in order to do that. Uh, so we'll build a catapult in here to try to help take down the privateer. Uh, there's no privateer here anymore, so we can just hit the city. Uh, eventually, we might want to build... If we can't get those horsemen down there fast enough, we could build uh, a horseman or something. I guess it would have to be one of these two cavalry or queries or, uh, to ride down just to retake the city once we hit it a bunch. Oh, in fact, we can go a quicker way, perhaps. And I'll just leave this crossbowman in the fort. Uh, I'll put this guy in that fort. build up our holy site there as well. Ok, 
can make friends with Russia. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Got a pike and shot coming our way. Be nice if we had grape shot, but we don't. In a market economy, however, the individual has some possibility of escaping from the power of the state. Ah, there's the improved niter, but I don't even know if that would count if it's not a mine, but where the city was on it anyway. Uh, okay, we will move there to get away from that pike and shot. I will bring this guy down. Unfortunately, the pike and shot will be much stronger than our horsemen. We could upgrade one of them to a cavalry. Um, pike and shot might still be kind of a hard hitter, but... I think I'd like to build a couple caravels just to uh, help out down there and to help escort my uh, settlers that I'm building. In fact, I think we want to build some... Aha! Yeah. Let's put in our uh, cavalry card. Let's put in logistics. As, no, let's put in unit maintenance. Save money. Good. Yeah, now we'll pump out some Quirisers. Oops. Don't want to do that. Want to keep them moving. Alright, next turn. Muscat has made peace with us. Muscat has made peace with Mahanjadaro. Alright, we just got more gold. That's great. Okay, what do we want to build here? Nothing's super great. We could get an industrial zone that's worth plus two. We could get one there that's plus two. Commercial hub. Campus. Holy site. We don't have breathtaking appeal. If we put like a holy site down there, we would get a, a, an appeal there for a seaside resort. But it'd still only be charming, I think. So, uh, so what do we put down? Maybe nothing. Maybe let's just work on that amphitheater. Okay. So, in addition to our other um, counter spy, now we can counter spy as if uh, two levels more experienced. So we'll do that. Four turns left on the Great Zimbabwe. And we can promote both of these guys to cavalry now, and this to a field cannon. We'll keep hitting Detroit. Uh, we could build Renaissance mall walls, we could build an archaeological museum. Uh, I think I'll bet on an archaeological museum, although we should also... Why don't we just build more uh, Quirisiers and cavalry? Uh, let's start with Quirisiers. And we'll steal some more gold, because it's very lucrative. Pachacuti finished Broadway. Means he's doing pretty well in culture. Yeah, we're 
going for a culture victory, but we're not very far ahead in it. That's okay, because uh, you don't need culture, you just need tourism. And we'll be able to make lots of that soon. I'll declare friendship with you. We'll get open borders. Give me two gold per turn. Uh, do I have anything to trade? I could try to trade you some horses. It looks like you're a little light on them. Plus, we'd like you to get your Cossacks to attack uh, Poundmaker with. Any more? I'll take that. Any more? No. Anything else we could do? We're uh, full on alliances, so we can't do that. But uh, we could build privateers now. That's good. Let's get some of those. Send this down to help out. Uh, I want to start sending trade routes out of Washington uh, because I want uh, more production there for the Eiffel Tower. So I'll send it to Poland. I'll get the meeting house there. And... Um, maybe another cuirassier, maybe a field cannon. I'll just keep going for, with cavalry for now. We don't need any iron for our rough riders, so I might as well just keep using it right now. And we just became suzerain of Bologna. That's great. All right, there's that pesky caravel. That did so much damage before. Twenty-eight turns to get there. That's fine. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I can do that. One, two, three. One, two. Yeah, if we want to get all three of those sources, we're going to have to settle uh, on both ends. My empire is not heading towards bankruptcy, because every eight turns I get to steal close to 2,000 from Canada. Okay, now Cree's sending even more forces. Uh, hopefully our Caraval and Privateer get down there soon enough to deal with all of them. Buy a monument in there. Yeah, that'll fix it right up. Uh, we'd like our ancient walls. But uh, we probably won't keep it for now. What does this do? Grant one promotion, 50% combat experience to a military naval unit. Okay.
Oh, Bologna betrayed us. Handmakers just got envoys so everywhere. Well, we did get this wonder though. She desired and asked for, besides what he had given her out of his royal bounty. So she turned and went to her own country, she and her servants. Nice. So as you can see, this gets us that trade capacity. That's great. Uh, trade routes from the city get plus two gold for every bonus resource within three tiles of the city and the city's territory. Um, that's pretty good. We'll want to send a lot of trade routes out of there later. We finally got our Rough Rider. So we'll start building those. Uh, we got to figure out where to send Amani. Uh, here, I'd like to finish the dam, and then I'd like to build uh, the Grandmaster's Chapel. This will give us uh, faith when we uh, pillage improvements and districts. Uh, it will also let us buy land units with faith. We don't want to do that. We want to save our faith for national parks. But since we're going to war, um, this will allow us to increase our faith income a little bit, which is fantastic. Uh, what do we want to build here? Uh, we could get our trade route out. That's probably a good idea. So, yeah, let's do that. And why don't we just get the uh, promotion? No, we'll just hook that up for now. And uh, keep this caravel moving. We could build a builder here. We could finish our walls. Probably just finish our walls. The Kree are backing off, it seems, unless they're bringing their bigger force. Uh, okay. Ah, yes, time to build some Rough Riders. Finally time. So notice that uh, with Teddy, his only his only advantages at the start are... If we uh, open up Teddy here. Um, open up Teddy. Uh, his only advantage is at the start of this combat strength um, on home continent. And uh, he gets wild cards instead of dip diplomatic policy cards and the extra favor... Um, those all start at the beginning, and uh, they're okay. He's he's very good at early rushes because of that plus five combat strength. Um, but we didn't go to war with him, so everything else, you know, like America uh, being as as young as it is, um, comes so late in the industrial era. And it took us this long into the game. This is the fifth um, episode in this series, and now we finally are getting our uniques. Um, but this is well past when a lot of other civs have have their uniques. Um, Although we're on a continent with some people, uh, Russia and Brazil, who get uh, uniques about the same time, uh, and France. Um, so it just so happens that way. But uh, yeah, so we had to get a lot of science to get to this point. Now we're finally at this point, so let's build our Rough Riders and get going. straight roads but the crooked roads without improvement are road all right so our alliance with brazil just ended at not a fantastic time uh, i will trade for open borders real quick uh, that'll just help us get in position better uh, but i won't make another alliance in fact i could de denounce them right now uh yeah this is going to rebel in two turns uh, we're probably going to be doing most of this without uh without Niter, unfortunately. Uh, if we put a Mani in there, or could do uh, Victor, why don't we just put a Mani in Detroit? That'll save us a little bit of time, but not much. Yeah. Um, let's see. Okay, I think... 
So here's what we want. We do want uh, Parks and Recreation on Liang. That'll take uh, four to get there. That will give us uh, City Parks, which can give us appeal um, and culture, um, which is great. I think maybe more importantly, we want Forestry Management, which will be great for getting appeal and getting extra gold from uh, unimproved features, including woods. Uh, so that's really strong to have in a city with a lot of national parks. So we we'll want those eventually. But for now, I think we'll want to finish off getting vertical integration with Magnus since we're about to go to war. Um, and this will just let us uh, build uh, troops at a really fast pace. Um, we'll also be able to get a strategic resource discount of 80%, which is nice. Um, so what can we do here in the short term? Uh, let's see. So we'll get Eiffel Tower in 10 turns. We'll be able to change our policies uh, in 5. Um, or we could go for that. How far are we from astronomy? That's four turns. Okay, so we'll, we'll hold off. We'll do steel first. Then we'll do astronomy. Uh, so I think we'll go for enlightenment right away, then maybe nationalism. Uh, so we won't put the wonder card in just yet. Uh, what do we want to put in? I think we'll put in... A feudal contract? No, we'll put in drill manuals for now. In fact, let's also, let's just try to keep that city as long as we can, just to get as much niter as we can. Uh, governors provide plus two loyalty, we'll put that in. And are we still building our settlers? Uh, I, don't, I don't really care if we are. Uh, let's get some gold. I think that'll be good. Actually, no. Let's get some industrial zone adjacency. Yeah, let's do that. Now we could just leave our army down here and keep taking it back as a free city. Uh, maybe that's what we want to do here. Need 29er to upgrade that. Yeah, so maybe we'll just leave these guys down here and we'll keep trying to take it back and forth, back and forth. Um, that's enough. That'll that'll give us at least some uh, niter along the way. Let's see, move this privateer. Nope, we can't commit to a friendship. Dun dun dun. Ah! And now the Kree are after it again. There's the Casa de Contracion. Uh, nope, not ready to declare war. That's a tempting hit. And we can finally take out that caravel. Great. One more turn and we'll be able to upgrade that. Damietta. Perfect. Uh, so who do we want? I think... Yeah, it'll be good to get France's uh, as a cultural alliance. So we don't get any pressure from them on our soon-to-be ours uh, Brazilian cities. Actually, before we do this, let's just get a little extra gold. And then we'll make an alliance.
Why not? There you go. Oh, shouldn't have done that. Oh, don't want to do that. I should have done that to him. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, well. Just 50 gold. Uh, look at the Statue of Liberty here. We don't want to get that, even though it is very American. Uh, just because we uh, don't need the diplomatic victory points. It would be really great if we could just instantly build it down here um, to keep Detroit loyal. Um, but sadly, we do not have a very strong industrial hub uh, down there. So let's just uh, keep building. Oh, uh, yeah, keep building Rough Riders, I guess. Four turns and until that flips. I'm not giving you my inhaler. Are you mad? here. Build Rough Riders here as well. Yeah, why not? The nice thing about the Rough Rider is uh, it's still in the industrial era, which means it still benefits from uh, this card here, Chivalry. Uh, it's the last kind of unit uh, to benefit from that. Uh, it's good, because otherwise we'd have to move very far in the Civics Tree to get the card that lets us build Rough Riders faster. So you don't have to worry about that, fortunately. There's a privateer out here that I'd love to sink. Yeah, we are just losing control of our city-states left and right. That's the problem with America, is you're not forced to use the Diplo um, cards for uh, envoy points or influence, so uh, you tend to not get very many envoys. Anyway, this is our Rough Rider uh, for building it for the first time, plus four error score. Uh, hopefully we get a Golden Age in the modern era, which will... Uh, let us use the two arms, uh, what's it called, um, cast a spelly for a golden age war, which is quite powerful, uh, doesn't get you, get, you, get you very many grievances, which is nice. Let us sink that privateer, let us patrol the coast here, heal up this Quirus here, get him in there. Okay, two turns till that rebels. Uh, more Rough Riders. All the Rough Riders, all the live long day. And send you over to Washington. Uh, yep. Yeah. Good. Again, we want to put all our traders in Washington just to get as much production as possible to uh, bash out the Eiffel Tower real quick. More Rough Riders. More! Good. Unlimited Rough Riders. opinion 
Humans are always suspected and usually opposed. That is a good amount of gold. So now we want to put in. Uh, we're just about to get steel. So we'll take out campus district adjacency. Uh, we will put in plus production to all wonders. Uh, we It's time to upgrade our units, so I'm just going to get rid of these loyalty things. We're about to lose that city anyway. And uh, put in the resource discount. There we go. Um, and what else? Uh, why not oligarchic legacy? Yeah, that'll be good. And is there anything we can upgrade right away? Uh, none of these things. Uh, we could upgrade that. Why don't we do that? Uh, it must be a friendly territory. That's right. So I'll send it back. Um, okay, what else can we upgrade? We can upgrade you. Scorched Earth. Fantastic. Uh, we could get that. We could get a musketman there. Uh, yeah. Yeah, oh, we don't really need these right away. Why don't we just put you in that encampment? Uh, I want to hold on to my nighter, build some bombards. Okay, I can upgrade you. Send you over. Upgrade you. I'll just upgrade you now. Could upgrade you, sure. And, uh, let's see, I'll put, oh, so we did get vertical integration, but I just remembered we don't have factories yet, so we don't have um, regional bonuses. So uh, we did want that in any way eventually, but it's not going to help us right now. Uh, so I think we'll put him over in New York and start building bombards out of New York. That's a good plan. Uh, next, we want nationalism. And now it's uh, five turns till steel because we took out the campus adjacency card, but that's all right. And we'll send that to La Rochelle. Actually, hold up. I want to make sure we're sending trade routes to everyone we can. Okay, St. John. Um, but for now, I also just want the production from our alliances, so we'll do that. The, the good thing is we're also filling out Washington's high um, housing limit by giving them more food. So what do we want to build here? Um, we get a little bit of extra production if we build a stable, so we'll do that. Now we can promote this. Uh-huh, okay. Sabotage production. Yeah, why not sabotage production? Uh, neutralized governor might also be good. Yeah, let's try sabotage. We just promoted the spy to the max level. Can we get any other spies? No, just the one for now. Okay. Uh, I think we still want him getting gold for us, though. Uh, that's just a really good use of spies to get us 2,000 gold every eight turns. That's pretty pretty tasty. Okay, just patrolling the coast here. Cree coast. And uh, I'm not sure what's going to happen to all of these units once it turns into a free city. Um, they'll probably pop out. I don't know exactly to where, but we will find out and we will deal with it. Why well, didn't denounce me? I'm allied with your enemy. Which one? Okay, there that is. Oh, okay, so my units got to stay put. That's good. Actually, I shouldn't even be hitting these guys. I should just be hitting the city. Because uh, as soon as I take the city back, they'll disappear. And uh, three turns for our armory. 
Uh, get more gold, why not? Maybe I should have gotten him the escape just for when he eventually gets caught, but I'm not worried about it right now. Wilfred's still a little behind us on the culture. I'll just send this guy up here to repair that. Uh, where do we want to attack first? Uh, that just went up quite a bit in terms of its garrison. That's alright though. Is it on a hill? No, not on a hill. Not on a hill. We probably want to go for Campinas first, so I guess I'll just move these guys over here. Ah, yeah, especially because they took our mountain tiles. In fact, so did uh, France here. I was not watching her borders quickly enough, and uh, I neglected to buy that mountain tile before we lost it to her. Am I in danger of losing anything here? No, we got everything here. Uh, well, that's too bad. We might have to attack France just to get that back at some point. Uh, or we might be able to make, make do with what we have. The beautiful thing about getting the Eiffel Tower is you can make a national park out of just anywhere out of uh, second growth woods that you plant with a builder. Okay, bring all our field cannons to bear. No, I'm not giving you three gold per turn. No. Oh, and I meant to denounce you. Okay, here we want to build up a lot of bombards. Oh. We want to wait until Magnus is in there, so never mind. We want to build a lot of Rough Riders. One more of those, and then a Bombard. We'll keep building Rough Riders here. experience on these guys. All right, and we take back Detroit. Rebellion in three turns, that's okay. Sure. Keep the city could put Amani back in. Is there a better place for Amani to go right now? Uh, probably not. We could take Fez. Uh, we could get Mahanjadaro, actually. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, seven. Oh, a Cod would be fantastic. Let's get a Cod. bring these ships back. They can actually help us take Detroit faster next time. Ah, I forgot to denounce Brazil again. Oh, Pigala was neutralized, that's fine. How 
much time we left, got left on this spy. Six more turns. Uh, I think we will probably want to start using him to counter spy now. Um, it'd be nice to get a bombard in here, actually. Okay, this time I'm going to remember to denounce you. And uh, then we'll do a formal war, since I don't think we have... Yeah, we don't have any of these, I don't think. And we don't have territorial war yet, although that's a colonial war. Okay. Uh, Fortified Defender, sure. We got a lot of red symbols over here. Um, I'm just kind of too lazy to clean it up right now. Pachacuti got Broadway, we remember that. Yeah, some of these are quite old. And our alliance level with Saladin increased. That's good. Oh, we, he lost Tamiata to, to, for France. And uh, France wasn't even Eleanor. So, that's funny. Oh, wait. We want to put the field cannon there. That's right. Three more turns to steal. Uh, why don't we just build our medieval walls then? One turn until this rebels, which is fine. Okay, even if we keep having to take back this city, it will, we will keep getting Niter, which is a good deal. Uh, we do have to worry about Brazil shooting at us, but that's okay. We'll just get some extra experience. These Quirus here are probably pretty tough. It's only 61. These Quirus here have 64 combat strength. Yeah, so we should be good. Easy. It's a little annoying, but at least we have Niter this way. Uh, let's get a commercial hub. We could really use some gold. And now that Magnus is established, we will build our bombards, uh, and they will use significantly fewer resources. They were using 20, now they are using 4. Nationalism in 7 turns to make cores. Everything's going pretty well. Uh, let's get some field cannons up. you fools. That caravel's probably gonna catch up to our galley and destroy us. Roar Valley? Oh, yeah, we're friends. Did you even have to ask? Uh, any oil over this way? Ideological differences? I don't even have an ideology. Saladin, Poland, you are our friends. I'll send you an embassy. I will give you open borders. 
Uh, what kind of... We had a religious alliance with you. Sure. I'll give you open borders. I had a research alliance with you. Fantastic. I know you love that. You love science. And Rough Riders. And what do we want here? An art museum, probably. Next turn. Sure. Sure, I'll take your embassy. The best steel. Doesn't always shine the brightest. All right, we got our steel. We can finally build our Eiffel Tower. It will only take 18 turns, which is great. Uh, what are we getting? We're getting 77 production there. this on a hill? No, that's not. Uh, with steel, we also just unlocked artillery. We do need oil for that. Um, so we will wait until our settlers actually get near oil. Uh, there's one. Do we lose the other one? Oh, no, they're both there. Okay, there's one. There's the other. We have a lot of rough riders. Uh, sure, I'll make peace with you for now. One last thing. And, uh, did we just lose a cod? Yeah. So now we have Amani back with us again. All right, let's just start this war. Você verá como lhe será infrutífero, não é? Very fruitless. All right, now what do we do? Uh, well, we could start by pillaging, if we could, anyway. Uh, we'll start by just taking out whatever units we can, any way we can. Um, we have such a high production that I'm not even very worried um, about uh, retaliation at this point. Uh, so we will surround Campanas. Uh, oh, we'll, we look, would like to get one more there. Over there to finish the surround. Uh, that's all we'll do for right now. And we'll try to back it up, get this guy there. We would like to get our bombard in this position. 
And we'd like to turn it into cores. Basically, at this point, we're just swarming them with numbers. Just to see how much damage. Not very much at all. Ah, now that we have steel, this city also got steel. Uh, that's unfortunate. That means it'll take a little bit longer to get down this time. But take it, we shall. Oh, I forgot about this guy. We should bring him down. Okay. We'll want to keep building bombards here for now. Uh, we can get a, another governor. Uh, we can reassign you already? Okay. We'll put you in Washington. And uh, why don't we get Raina next? Uh, where do we want to put her? I guess Detroit. Um, yeah, we'll just put her in Detroit for now. Keep spamming Rough Riders. Okay, we got our thing built a check. What? Oh, that's a different dam. Okay, it's a different river. Uh, I was worried that this wasn't really built. Uh, but it is built, and so we have a fair bit of food there. Okay, we want to move you back to Washington. And what do we want to build here? We could build a bank. We could finish our theater square. We could build Rough Riders. I think we'll go for the Theater Square first. We are going for a culture win after all. Um, okay, we will move this counter spy back to Washington. It doesn't quite matter where we put him because uh, he'll protect all of the uh, things, but he'll get plus one uh, near him. So I don't know. We'll just keep him in the city center. I can't remember if the, off the top of my head if, um, oh, there it is, okay. Um, wait, why? I don't know why we got that, but anyway, we want to pillage, uh, we want the raid ability, and why don't we get drill manuals as well, uh, or why don't we just get chivalry, leave chivalry in, and, uh, yeah, and leave everything else same. I mean, this isn't doing much good for us because we're not using any of those guys. Uh, are we close to getting a great general? Not really. So there's no point putting that in. 
Um, oh, we could get extra gold this way. How many? I'm trying to decide if we'd get more gold this way or the other way. So seven, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. So it's a, it's about even. But we'll just uh, we'll just use the this one. This will also give us faith. So that's good. Um, okay, and then we wanted that and a raid. Raid. There we go. Could also use unit maintenance, but reduced by two by one. Sorry. Anyway, pillage you for health, and you can uh, ride away a little bit. Let's see, pillage you for faith. And hit you. Oh, pillage you for science. Fantastic. And hit you. Hit you again. Ride you over there. Uh, I could pillage this one again, so I will. Whenever we can, we want to leave these Rough Riders on hills, because they get higher defense there, or, well, and higher attack. Just higher combat strength. And from all that raiding, we just picked our faith up quite a bit. There's that boost. Alright, I think we just want to heal this guy. So we'll hide him around here. Hopefully the uh, volcano doesn't erupt. And uh, we'll want to leave you there. Get pillage. And move back. Pillage here. Move you back. Shoot. Shoot. Uh, okay, we didn't want to uh, move that one in the way. We'll pillage here. And move. Nothing good to pillage. We'll just move you back to safety. We'll just keep getting hit here. I don't mind. Could take out that. No, we couldn't quite. Let's, uh, let's just move up. Up, and then there's two of them. Alright, we'll just leave you there. Uh, we could try moving you closer, just to see what happens. We're going to move you to safety. I'm going to promote you. Uh, he has a lot of, well, he has a lot of anti-cav and range, but I think we'll just go with that one. Okay, now what do we want? Uh, we don't... We won't actually be able to get oil for a little bit. Um, and we don't have a good place for the Golden Gate Bridge. So we probably just want to go straight for radio. Actually, why don't we see if France wants to join our war, join ongoing war against Pedro. Perfect. How about you? Holy war against Pedro. Ten gold per turn. Do I even have that? What if I just give you... Uh, ten by ten. Uh, what if I give you five hundred? Oop. You'll take that. Or 10 by 30, right? Okay. Uh, 250. You'll take that. What about 200? No. Mm -hmm. 
221. Okay. Sure. And what about you, Kree? Are you still attacking? Alright, let's get everyone to attack Pedro. We'll just be sure that we actually get the cities. Is that totally pillaged? It is, so why don't we move on to that fort? I'm uh, sure we can get all of these. Now that we've gotten to the uh, Eiffel Tower, we don't really need science as much anymore. Uh, we do want to get to radio, but there's there's no rush. We'd really like to get uh, up to uh, conservation after nationalism. Uh, by the way, just a little tip in case you didn't know this. Uh, maybe I should have said it earlier. You can queue up one thing and then press shift and click to queue up others. Um, so it's just a little handy planning thing. Wilfred's building a lot of wonders. We might have to worry about him. We want to declare friendship with him later. There we go. Friends. Oh, that volcano did erupt. Fantastic timing, at least we survived. We'll be able to put that around back after it heals up a bit. Totally pillaged? It is. Maybe it would be easier if I just did that. Can't tell. Uh, what else do we want to pillage? Well, we could try to take out this guy. No, that won't work. Build a market there. Heal you up. Uh, what else? Okay. Uh, we could use some range for those pike and shots. Yeah, so I'll keep building some ranged and uh, build rough riders in the back. Counter spot. I'll just leave them in the city center. Uh, we want to keep building bombards here. Eh. <laughs> I guess that's the quickest way. Sometimes the straightest path is not. Um, Alright, we want to put a flank on you, so we'll get there. Perfect. Alright, we want to get as many casualties as possible for culture, although I should have done that with this Rough Rider in order to get the culture for the kill. Um, I just remembered I can keep shooting at that just to get some experience. Uh, I don't want to lose this, so I should probably back it up. Although, I might have been able to get those defenses had I left it. Um, what's this? Three turns till it rebels. Alright, we'll just leave everything... Oh, leave everything here the same. Oh, we want an alliance with you. Uh, an economic alliance, sure. Take our embassy. Okay, and more Rough Riders. You should still be exploring. This is where it's really going to slow down. 
Uh, we might not be able to do everything in one go at this point. I think I'll just want to heal you up. Okay, next turn. I'll try to be faster. Um, that's not a great deal. Sure, I'll take that. Oh, there goes that field cannon. Okay, there's plenty more where that came from. Alright, I want this one for myself so I can get an extra trade route. Uh, what do we want? I think we want more loyalty just as just in case as we start taking these. So let's do five and that should be fine by itself. Uh, I could probably get away with only putting two here, but just to be safe, I'll put three. And, uh, oh, they elected for me to get minus loyalty. Um, interesting, interesting. Well, at least I get population growth. Human nature oh, and what was the other one? I didn't see it. In tribalism and nationalism. Provides the momentum of the machine oh, yeah. Of yeah, well, that's right. Okay. Um, all right. See, it says we're behind on culture. That's because we haven't started using our national parks, but we will soon. Yeah, we're down here. Says we have no tourists yet. Um, that's fine. Tourism is a late game thing, and we are ready for it. Uh, we just got our first great musician. We have nowhere else to put it for now, so. There you go. Oh, and this era is about to tick over in 10 turns. Uh, so it won't go as long as I feared it would. Uh, we could build that trader here. Uh, I think we'll just buy the trader. start buying a lot of things now. Um, like we could just buy a Bombard core. That would be useful. Oh yeah, we could put everything into cores now. How are we losing this? Okay, well we're gonna promote you to forestry management and we're gonna assign you to uh, that city, Belen. We'll put Amani in uh, Detroit for now. Detroit's just going to hell. Sorry, Detroit. And uh, why don't we build a, a barracks here instead of a stable? I think we built a barracks here as well, right? Yeah, that's a barracks. Alright, now we have cores. Okay, uh, we'd still like that. I think we'd like both, all of these right now. Uh, once we finish the Eiffel Tower, we'll be able to take that out. 
Uh, we are rating quite a bit, so we might want to keep that in there. Alternatively, now that we've done our initial rating, we could put in National Identity to uh, take less damage, have higher combat strength when we're injured, um, and more uh, gold that way, perhaps. Uh, that might be with the way to go. Um, we could also pump out things faster if we put in the, the appropriate cards. That's another way of going. Um, right now, I think we, we want to just keep pumping out cavalry. They're the ones that are soaking up the most hits. Um, we just want, we're just waiting for our other, um, uh, bombards to get in position and we'll make a core here that should be able to take that down fairly quickly. Um, once we get the surround on it, we just need to heal up first. Okay. We took out the walls here. Now we could take the encampment if we wanted. So we could first get the surround on it, then hit it a few times. Take out that cannon. Excellent. Now we could uh, march on Sao Louis. South by South Louis. Great. And uh, what about Oil Island? We're getting there. Slowly but surely. Uh, why don't we move this over and promote it with our ally? Uh, we could make friends with the Kree. Um, I don't think we're going to get to him in 30 turns, so we might as well. Uh, all of our alliances are used. Oh, we could get a military alliance with him. That would be pretty handy. He is at war with our enemy, so why don't we do that? Um, and that way we'll get extra combat strength against Brazil. Uh, we can make friends with Spain. We'll send you an embassy, and that's it. Uh, we'll send you an embassy as well. Once our enemies, now our friends, because we're being dicks on our continent. But you know, we're America, that's what we do. It's, uh, it's the industrial era, it's time to take land. Uh, eastward ho, as they say. That famous American expression. Nope. Give me a good deal and I'll say yes. Okay, let's do that one. Yeah, we could take you out. I'm all for that. Why don't we send one Rough Rider around if we can find one? Yeah, why don't we send you up and around this way? Heal you up. Heal you. Uh, you're already healed. And where do we want to put you? I guess we'll just move you back where you were. We want to come make a core of these guys, so we'll move him up back to safety. Uh, we could put you there. In fact, we should leave a bombard uh, there instead, so we'll move you out. 
And that bombard will just help us chip away at that encampment. Um, oh, don't tell me we can't build bombards anymore. That's real bad. Because I was uh, counting on those. Oh, well. Well, we'll finish out this one. Actually, I'd like this guy here to keep that fort for us, that hillside fort. One, two, three, four, five. Yep, we have all of those. Eleven turns on the Statue of Liberty. We have nowhere for Vivaldi to play, so we'll put him to sleep. Bleak. Like uh, the 1812 overture over here. Oh, this is our first theater square with three or more. It's not the towering colonialism. The Great. spread of the rule of reason. All right. Uh, so yeah, we'll move you back. Take you there. We just want to heal up our units for now. Yeah, keep healing everything. Assign you to Detroit again. What else could we build? We have an industrial zone. We could build a pretty good industrial zone right here. We could build an encampment somewhere. Yeah, we could build an encampment there. Or just there. Um, that industrial zone is sort of calling to me though. Or a harbor. That wouldn't be a bad idea. I think we'll build that industrial zone. Why not? Once we uh, once we get factories there, that'll really help New York. Okay, we have two envoys to send. Where do we want to send those? We could get a cod back from uh, Poundmaker uh, with Amani. We could take that back. So I'll send her to Mahenjadaro. Uh, we still want Wonders in, we still want the adjacency. Uh, that's all good for now. And, yeah, we'll just leave that there. Alright, we won't be able to take down the walls that quickly, but we will be able to take them down. So that's what we're going to do. Um, I think I want to put this guy over in there. Just, again, to chip away at this encampment. Help us get that city. Just need to keep healing over there. Uh, just fortify you. In fact, wait, that's a core? Yeah, that's a core. Need another field cannon. Oh, it's costing quite a bit. That's interesting. Oh, 
was pillage. And uh, it's got one more pillage in it, right? Yeah, okay. What's that look like? Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Uh, we've gotten our faith really high just by doing this raiding with the faith. Oh, we still need to take that one back. Okay. Um, so that's very useful. Um, just keep that in mind as you play Teddy. Uh, when you when you do go to war, you'd like the Grandmaster's Chapel, um, and you can use the, the raid card to really make it powerful. Oh, I forgot. I wanted to send this one here, didn't I? I think I'll just put in Grand Armée and Chivalry now. Wilfred's still been building a lot of wonders. Oh, fine, I'll take that deal. I'm too lazy to uh, negotiate right now, to haggle. Blood mitigated, great. What can be labeled? Uh, let's see. Extract an artifact. We're we're about to discover where they are. Then we'll be able to buy an archaeologist and extract an artifact. Uh, if we wanted to build a neighborhood, we could boost that. So why don't we do that? Get urbanization. Actually, let's get urbanization. Then natural history and conservation. Just try to boost it, just to get a little bit uh, faster. Uh, we could build another spy. Um, why don't we do that? Okay, and swing this guy back around that way. We want to send this one over there as well. Uh, oh, we could build the Venetian Arsenal. That'd be great. Uh, we could build it here. Perfect. Um, that'll allow us to build double ships if we need them. Might be good if we decide to attack the Kree. And here... Uh, I think... Some field cannons... Probably. Alright, we'll be able to attack that encampment with this on the next turn. Great. Fill you up. Heal you up, heal you up. Heal you. Okay, they're all healing. Oh, shit. Okay, well. Hopefully we can get these down quickly enough. Uh, we'll wait for the barbarians to walk away, hopefully. Yeah, I was afraid that was going to happen. Hermitage.
What just happened? Okay, whatever. That was a weird shuffling that just happened. Um, I was trying to get this uh, healthy one down here uh, to take the two shots. We might not want to leave them there, because these just, they survive better on the hills, so it's probably where we want to leave them. Ah, this just rebelled. Actually, I don't want to do that. I want to keep taking it. Uh, okay, Rough Rider. And now that's building the Venetian Arsenal. We got uh, seven more turns on the Eiffel Tower. Perfect. Heal you up. We want a cod. We got a Mani and Mahanjadaro. Sure. Let's try that. Uh, and Valletta, why not? Get some extra production out of our uh, barracks and stables. Alright, just promote you. Heal you up. Got to uh, wait before uh, landing, but we did manage to do it anyway. So let's just uh, settle real quick. Boom, and we get a shot. And why don't we buy? Uh, well, we can purchase the cheapest unit we can. Let's see. Oh, we can buy bombards again. Oh, I guess because. Uh, we have a uh, 29er, that's probably the reason why we couldn't buy it before. Uh, let us buy... Well, let's just use a ranger. They're pretty fun to play with. Okay, so... Oh yeah, there it is. So we will build a Bombard core right after this spy. I guess you need to have the amount that you need in order to buy it. Or maybe I just didn't see it before, honestly. Oh well, it happens. Uh, we can put a harbor down. Uh, yeah, we might as well just put it there. We're never going to finish it, probably. Yeah, we're not going to finish it. Um, why don't we buy the 
monument too. While we're at it, we can also buy another trader here. Um, or if we're confident that we can finish that out, we could move it there. Um, but I think just here because that's a good place to put it. It's a good place as any. Healing you or keep you fortified anyway. Uh, ah, yes, village. Uh, that would take two hits right there. Why don't we just move you there for now? And we got our free builder. We should probably move you back where we want you. Keep shooting you, just whittling away. If we get there, we'll get hit twice and quite possibly die, so we won't do that. Instead, we'll just heal and we'll heal here. And we have to take this out again. We are getting lots of experience on our boys, though. So that's just fine. Uh, we will move you over to Washington as well. And uh, let's get Aleppo just to make sure that we're getting stuff from Arabia. And that's fine. We'll just heal you up. Okay. Looks like it's pretty safe to settle there. Plus 20 diplomatic favor. Four turns. Ah, oh, we would like a Golden Age next era. It doesn't look like it's going to happen, though. No. There can be no peace. So what can we say? Um, we got kind of screwed on the Niter. Uh, we're going to try to get some now. Uh, it it would have been nice to have our Bombards earlier, to have started this earlier, just because he has pretty heavy walls. Uh, once we get our oil up, we can actually start going for that now. Uh, well, we need to get all the way to the sea oil wells, unfortunately. Um, so we probably just want to go for radio first. Um, then, honestly, we might just want to go for advanced flight and get bombers instead of uh, oil. But we'll see. Um, yeah, so we'll just keep going for radio for now. Uh, we'll just let our bombard again chip away uh, now we have this core uh, we can't promote it unfortunately let's see yeah if only we had uh, John Rockefeller we could buy James Watt that's pretty good builds a factory and workshop in this district factories provide plus two production so I'll take that We'll try moving this up again. It'll probably just get hit, but we will see. Uh, promote you.
Uh, where do I want to send this guy? I want to get gold. Uh, London has 1,000. Astrakhan 400. Ottawa is probably still going to be the highest. Yeah, let's just try Ottawa again. Hopefully it doesn't get caught. Uh, let's send you to Krakow. Uh, okay, we have our free deuter. Uh, we can put lumber mills down, that's good. Uh, we could also chop out this uh, bombard core if we wanted. In fact, maybe that's the thing to do. We have all these hills here, um, and we only want to leave these jungles for this plus three. Uh, yeah, let's just do that. Uh, we'll heal you up. Heal you up. Oh. Hmm, okay, so there's some more oil over there, but that's out of reach when we can't fiddle over there for sure. Yep, another uh, solid hit on us here. And uh, we caught a spy. We caught a French spy stealing a tech boost in Washington. So, good thing we have a counter spy. Boom, that ranger. Boom goes the dynamite. Alright, what do we want to do in Buffalo? Honestly, we should probably get a builder and just put uh, some farms down and over here. Some farms down there too. Oh, we never, uh, we never, we forgot to boost that uh, Great Zimbabwe using this guy. I guess it didn't really matter. We could chop these down. We could put lumber mills on them. We could uh, get another builder here. Sure thing. Slowly but surely. Okay, now that the walls are coming down, our boys can do some damage to its health. So, now it'll come down a bit faster, and we'll get some momentum going. Counter spy again. Uh, where do we want to put our factory? Uh, well, if we wait until this one is built, we'll be able to just get a workshop and a factory right away. On the other hand, this we could benefit from the factory here right now. Uh, so I say, yeah, we just do that. We could buy a workshop for pretty cheap. So, boom, we have a factory. And uh, we'll figure out if we have any coal. Hopefully we do. We'll get this city one more time.
why don't we... Eh, I'll just put her in there for now. Although that's still falling slowly. I guess I'll take Amani out. Put her in uh, Charleston. Sorry to lose Mahendradaro, but that's fine. We're never going to get that one either, that's okay. We should be able to take this in a couple turns. We only have one turn left until the next era. Cities is that everything is king size. The beauty. All right. Well, we finally got a city. Um, the first time we conquered one that hadn't already been flipped from uh, loyalty pressure. Uh, we're getting a lot of loyalty pressure from Brazil. We shouldn't be getting any from France, otherwise this would be flipping even faster. Uh, I think we want to put... Uh, let's just put her over here. We could... Oh, sorry. Uh, Amani. We can move her back to Charleston when we need to for now. Put her in Campinas. Uh, we'd like... What's his name? Victor. With this uh, garrison commander promotion for more loyalty. Uh, so hopefully we can pick that up soon. Uh, we only have one more... Uh, turn for this uh, defend against range uh, turn for this stream though now we can attack Porto Alegre uh, we just want to get this guy to safety right now so is that pillaged? I think it is yeah uh, so we will keep that city it's already got a money in it. Four turns to repair the monument. Um, it's too bad about that one tile. Hopefully we can get enough national parks elsewhere. For instance, there's a there's already a good one right here. Once we put some forests down and get rid of that uh, rainforest, that'll make for a national park once we have the Eiffel Tower in two turns. Sorry, you won't get to see it this round. You'll get to see it next round uh, or the, the next episode. Let's keep building... Uh, let's, let's go back to building Rough Riders, I suppose. That we got a, another Bombard in two turns. Just combining all these units. put a farm down here, or I could put a lumber mill down. Who's working it? Oh, okay. Yeah, why don't we just uh, chop it out and put a farm down? We're not using it for anything. And next turn? Oh, not quite. Uh, put you there. And now next turn. We were four era, era score shy of the Golden Age, unfortunately, which would have been wonderful. Uh, we would have gotten the Two Arms Golden Age dedication. Uh, so it's unfortunate that we didn't, but it's fine. Uh, we, we are doing fine without it uh, in terms of loyalty. Uh, I just want to check real quick to make sure that Brazil also got a Normal Age or a Dark Age so that we don't get severe loyalty pressure from him. Uh, and Brazil got a Dark Age, which is very good for us. Uh, well, we no longer have any uh, problem with loyalty in either of these two cities, and uh, that should continue as we continue making our way across Brazil in the modern age. Uh, but that is the end of today's episode. Thank you for watching.
if you liked, like, and subscribe, please leave a comment. I would love all the feedback I can get, including constructive criticism. Let me know how I can do better. And uh, see you next time. Bye.